Hi Vogue, it's Kelsey Harding and this is my skincare routine. Okay, I'm totally joking you guys, but I have wanted to try this Vogue Beauty Secrets type of video forever and today I am going to be doing it. I have all my products in front of me and I am just going to be showing you guys my skincare routine, how I keep my skin nice and healthy and I'm also going to be showing you a natural dewy makeup routine for a nice summer's day or you know just like a little a little nicer. Let's just get straight on into it. First up, I have washed my face just to wake me up or clean my face from the day. And the face wash that I use is the CeraVe Foaming Facial Cleanser. This works so well, definitely recommend. Well, actually, before I even do that, I put on my little cute pink headband. It's super fluffy and stretchy. Cetaphil, which is the best moisturizer I can recommend, especially now during the winter time. I definitely have dry skin. So I put on a good amount to make it really moisturizing. And I've noticed with my skincare routine that sometimes hard to keep a consistent routine. I have used this literally every single day ever since three years ago and definitely it has helped my skin a lot. Okay, I'm going to move on to my deodorant, the Target Old Spices Wilderness Scent one. Just looks like that. Okay, so I am finished with my skincare. Now I'm going to apply some perfume. This is the Thousand Wishes one from Bath and Body Works. So a few squirts of these. Before I move on to like the makeup, I want to introduce this new product. It is the Shelly Shelly Volume Dry Shampoos. I have never tried any dry shampoo in my life until my sister bought this for us. For a little bit. <laughs> Smells divine. And then you just have to like style it how you want it. I'm not gonna use a lot. Okay, next up, we are finally moving on to the makeup part, which is definitely my favorite. Peachy Glow Instago CC Cream from The Body Shop. It's, it's not like full coverage foundation, so I don't like to wear a lot of heavy makeup every single day because I go to school. Just apply a little bit, or I mean, I don't have or use foundation. This is used to blend out, make your face all look the same kind of like tone. Next up, I am going to be using the Mary Kay Cream Blush Duo Stick. This is like the closest product I can find to the Ellie Thuman Bubel. I will link it down below for you guys. So it's split into two. I use a little bit of the red side, go up for a little sunburn look, and then a little, and then just use my beauty blender again. Now I'm going to be using the other more glittery side. Now that I'm done with that, I am going to be going in with some powder blush and bronzer. This is also for Mary Kay. I think putting on cream and powder blush just makes it more fun. Now I'm going in with the bronzer. Moving on to eyeshadow, I use this Body Shop palette. It is called the Own Your Naturals palette and it has a lot of natural shades this one and this one and if I'm feeling a little fancy a little bit of a darker color okay moving on to the lighter shade do it in more of the inner corners next up is this Mary Kay mineral powder I don't do this all the time mostly just if I want more of like a if it's looking a little crazy like it is I'm just going to fix it up with some of this and put it under my eyes So for my brows, I use just normal Vaseline to keep them in place as like the brow gel and then I use the Brow Ultra Slim Maybelline New York Color Stick. First I use the color, not every time I use the color, but if I'm going out then I will use the little pencil that it comes with. So I've colored in my brows and now I'm just going to quickly brush them through because it helps like the color like move where you want it to. This is also kind of like a get ready with me. Then I just dip it in the Vaseline, use a bit and then just color them in to keep them in place, make them look a little darker. 
we're gonna grab my eyelash curler from the dollar store. I know I haven't gotten like a better one, but I haven't needed to switch it out. It's actually worked pretty well. I do have a little leftover mascara on from today. So I just like squeeze it for about five to 10 seconds. And then quickly while that is still together, I like to use Falsies Lash Lift Mascara by Maybelline New York. This one I really like, my parents got it for me in my stocking. I have used it ever since, I'm totally obsessed. Like you can see the before and after, but the kind of makeup look I like is like a natural with not like a thin wispy eyelash look with more of like a full, there we go. I never really ever do my bottom lashes because the mascara, when I'm applying it, it just naturally goes to my bottom lashes or I just like a full top lash look. And to finish this look off, I am going to be using the Mary Kay Clear Glittery Gold Nourishine Plus Lip Gloss. I love a natural makeup look for your skin and everything and then use a glossy lip. That's my favorite look ever. And this is my finished makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed learning my skincare routine and thank you Vogue for letting me share my skincare routine, a few tips I have and a natural makeup look. Thanks for watching, bye. Did I'm